Hi Aquarius, this is Kathy. Welcome to my channel, Kathy Mamelin, Psychic Medium. Welcome to a timeless love reading. It's a general love reading for my Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and any cross watcher. Let's see what's going on around you with love. Let's see what spirit has for you. What's next? What's coming your way? Anything about a connection you may be in? I am listening for you now, spirit. Any messages of guidance that you want to share? I am listening. Let's see what we have today. I've got friendship. Okay, maybe somebody started out as a friendship. Maybe this is my best friend. That's always a nice feeling that the person that you're in love with is your best friend also. So that's important. But friendships can turn into romantic relationships. Asking for help, surrounding yourself with support systems, friends, spirit guides. I have the future, wondering about my future, almost like a looking into a crystal ball feeling like, is this the person that I have a future with? Is this the person that I should be thinking about a future with? And let's get one more. I have a deep dive. Deep emotions is coming into me. So I have a deep dive, deep connection. Something's going on with somebody's energy around you. So I like the, I like this deep, um, I like the deep dive energy. I like the deep connection feeling I'm getting. Um, how about, you know, emotions are deep, something like that, that, you know, we're starting to realize that this is turning into something so much more. Maybe it started out as a friendship for some of you. Um, so let's see what spirit has. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome to anybody that's new. Please remember to hit that like and subscribe button. Comment below. Love for you to join us. Let's see what spirit has um, with these deep feelings. What are these deep feelings that we have? Is somebody, somebody, uh, I must feel like these feelings are coming to the surface. I've got a, a knight of pentacles. I have a star. I have a higher fan. And I have a death card. Okay, so letting something go so that I can invite something new into my life. And almost a feeling of rebuilding, you know, a, a feeling of rebuilding um, even your own spiritual strength. This could have been, you know, your own spiritual journey that the break in between um, relationships has allowed you to grow, has allowed you to do some inner soul uh, searching. Even this deep dive could be your own emotions with what is it that you're wishing for? What is it that you're hoping for? So this, the, your own spiritual journey, I feel like is leading you towards, you know, the sense of wishes coming true, um, you know, wishes come true energy that I did the work and therefore I'm in a better place, something like that. Ten of Wands, it wasn't easy. It wasn't easy to get to where you are today. I have a Knight of Cups in my star. So it's what you hope for. It's what you're dreaming of. I wanted something more is how it's coming into me. So if you wanted a relationship that was, you know, more emotionally connected, a deeper emotion, a more spiritual connection, you feel like you're more of a soulmate with this person, or you feel that this person was put in your life for a reason. I'm going to say that that is what's coming. If you haven't, this hasn't arrived, you'll manifest it. If this is in your life now, then you can confirm this love. But it's a feeling of um, contentment. It's a feeling of building. It's a feeling of working together. It's a feeling of I, I wanted more and I asked for more and I feel like spirit is rewarding you. I love this feeling of you made a good choice, like you chose you. And yeah, because you just knew something was better out there. And this is this could be where you're at right now is I just know something is better out there. I know my partner, my twin. This is even like a twin flame connection coming into me, the way that that mirror reflection, we're mirroring each other. We are clo so close that we feel like we know everything about each other. So this is going to be a very deep soul connection. I'm going to say it that way that somebody is coming into your energy or has come into your energy that it's a deep soul connection and you can feel it in your soul you can feel that this is the right one and and that's what you want you want to just i mean it just keeps getting better as i go um king of wands 
King of Wands, Knight of Cups, you know, just this feeling of somebody who is so in love with you. And that's maybe it's been a long time that you felt that way, but you will know that this person is in love with you. You will know that they they love you with their heart and soul. Um, they are deeply in love with you. Um, and that is that is how they're feeling. So if you're questioning how are they feeling, where is this headed, what what's happening next in this connection. I want you to trust the feelings that are coming into you. I want you to, you know, feel the love. I want you to feel the energy coming towards you. Let's see what else they say. The passion, there's insane chemistry here. I love this feeling of, I know that I'm passionate about you. I can feel the sparks flying. I can feel the, the energy. So we definitely have passion in this connection. We're talking. We are getting text messages from this person. We are constantly communicating. I like that. Somebody reaching out to you, taking a chance on this person. You know, if you feel like you don't know where you stand or do they have the same feelings as you, um, I'm going to say in a very short period of time, this person's going to be revealing their feelings that they're deeply in love with you that they can't hold back i do feel like this is a twin flame connection of some kind um i you know the passion coming in the desire coming in this deep connection that i'm feeling so i i do feel like there is a sense that this is uh divinely sent um it just came into me that this was you know this is meant to be and let's get one more yes twin flames or soul connection but a deep, obviously, it's a deep soul connection across across the board. Spirit, let's get some yes and no uh, for my Aquarius. Yes and no questions. What is it about this connection I need to hear? What do we need to know? I have a no, a rebirth. We're going through a dark night of the soul. The space between who they were and who they will become. Now, I'm going to say not so much them, but you, because I did have that energy earlier that you're taking the time for your own spiritual growth, that you're the one having the rebirth, that you're the one finding yourself, your soul, and, and looking for this true soul connection and not willing to accept anything less than that. So I feel like that's your rebirth um, in this reading. I'm saying, yes, slow and steady. Some old fears still linger, but they want to get to know you better. Don't rush it. Take your time. Within the next six months, we will know if this is the connection that's meant to be. So if you feel like they're holding back in any way or they're not showing you their hand in those in that cards, uh, I think you're gonna. it's going to be revealed to you. Yes, this is a true love. They realized that they loved you after they lost you. Now feelings very regretful. A surprise is coming. So for some of you, not all of you, that could be reconnecting to some of your, your somebody from your past, or it could be a twin flame from a past life that finds you in this lifetime. So keep that in mind. But they realize that they love you. I'll take that true love any day. And then I have no devoid of light, not in a good place emotionally right now heartbreak or depression. So this could be you. This could be them. You've got to get through and have this rebirth of I'm in a better place so that you're both emotionally available to be in this relationship. But they just, just reminded me of all this talking. Now, part of me is feeling that this is somebody that if you are working through some old issues, that if you are struggling with a feeling of um, I'm still healing, you can heal and fall in love at the same time. You know, there's nothing that's holding you back. Um, so from doing the both, and this person could be the person that helps you to do that. Let's get another one. And yes, this is a new beginning. They hope to get the relationship off the ground and give it a fair chance. So there's this feeling of 
I want to get to know you. I'm going to call you. I want to get this started, right? So lots of text messages, lots of back and forth, just constantly waiting for your messages. Um, I like that energy, like their phone rings and, and, you know, there's a little bit of anticipation and, and they kind of jump, you know, when that phone rings because they can't wait to see what your response is next or they just are excited to keep hearing from you. So we are, um, I, I like this feeling of the deep connection and getting to know each other. I think that that's important. Let's see what else they say. Spirit, tell me more. I have a seven of wands. Queen of Pentacles. I have a two of wands. And I have a lover's card. Beautiful. So I have this beautiful gateway opening to our future. And I feel like this is in my heart. I feel like this is in my soul. I, this is a deep soul connection. They keep saying that. And this is a, a wish coming true. Um, but they're going to reveal that they're deep, falling deeply in love with you. And I think even just that anticipation I felt a moment ago with the... Um, the, I can't wait to get your next text message. I can't wait to hear from you that this is going to turn into something so much more. So if this person hasn't revealed their feelings, get ready for I'm falling deeply in love with you. And, and I want to see where this is going. Spirit, tell me more. What else do you need me to know today? I'm faithful to you. I'm faithful to this connection. I've been dreaming of you. I can't get you out of my mind. I like this. I'm happy with you. I see a future with you. I want a future with you. Um, I want to compromise, you know, make this work. How do we make this work? I want to stay together. I want to be faithful and stay together. Oh, beautiful. And this is a deeper commitment. Absolutely. They keep saying the same thing. Um, so we're, we're definitely, this is a romance blooming. This is exciting. I'm going to contact you within a week. Um, they're very attracted to you. No doubt in my mind. Um, showing affection. I love this feeling of um, staying together. Where's my dream of dreaming of you? You know, showing affection, romance, blooming, um, just dreaming of you. You know, that that kind of euphoric energy that happens that that comes into your life. And and they realize that this is a deeper connection, that this is something that I've wished for. This is something that I've been waiting for. I have been hoping to meet somebody just like you. So right now you've got somebody that's falling deeply in love with you. And if it hasn't happened yet, we're going to manifest this because this is going to be um, the love that you've been waiting for and the love of a lifetime. So we're going to put this out into the universe. Cap um, sorry, Aquarius, this is for you. And this reading was for you. And um, but they're saying a couple more cards, please. Okay, I'm going to get a couple more cards. I got to listen to spirit. They want a couple more. A twin flame connection could be connecting to that twin flame. And online dating. Maybe they need you to know that you're meeting this person on social media of some kind. So maybe somebody out there needed to hear how I'm going to meet this person. So for today, it's online dating. Aquarius, let's put this out into the universe. I want to thank Spirit for this reading. If you're new to my cha channel, please remember to hit that like and subscribe button. Um, thank you for your kind words and comments always. If anyone would like to book a private reading with me, please check out my website at kathymamelinpsychicmedium.com.